Now, as long as you're in embed and when you click on the link it should take you to here that's in that message and when you say import into compiler it should say this where it's got the name hello world here we hit import then we can double click on test.cpp and it brings up our hello world program and all we have to do is compile say save file say OK go up to the top here left click then right mouse click on this and say open containing folder and grab this hello world and slide it down to DAP link and let go you should have putty configured so you should be able to just say open and when you hit the reset button the one beside the cable you've connected to your computer every time you hit that you should see the words hello world coming up now this version of the embed library does work with our board and with our serial port other versions that you may wish to go here and import will not work properly so once we have this program working what we can do is create another program by just clicking here right mouse clicking and saying clone and in this case we're going to call this one blinking underscore LED and when we say OK what we're going to see is that we have a new project set up here with this same embed library that does work and we're just going to click here and change some coding first thing we're going to have to do is say digital out with a capital O and a capital D everything else lowercase we're going to say red underscore LED and say capital LED one bracket semicolon and the comment that we're going to put in here is that red underscore lead is associated with the red lead and we can get rid of this stuff here and we can basically say red underscore led equals zero and the con and the thing here that we're going to put in is turn on red lead and underneath we're going to say red underscore led equals one and we're going to put in here a comment turn off red lead and we're going to put a loop above this we're going to say forever and then we're going to do between here and here but one of the things you're going to find is if you turn the red leads on and off they're going to be turned on and off so fast that you won't be able to see anything happening so what we're going to do in between these is we're going to put a wait statement and we're going to put wait underscore ms for milliseconds 500 and we're going to say wait 0.5 seconds and underneath here we're just going to copy and paste this we're just going to grab this we're going to control C we're going to hit enter we're going to put control B and so we have our program ready to go so let's check this program out first of all let's just do a compile and it seems fine so we're just going to hit save file we're going to say OK we're going to go up here we're going to right mouse click open containing folder and grab this and slide it down to DAP link wait for it to download and as soon as it does you'll see the flashing red lead